The northern lights are spectacular displays of moving coloured lights seen most often at high northern latitudes around the Arctic. They're also known as the Aurora Borealis, a name coined by Galileo in 1619, Aurora being the Roman goddess of the dawn, and Borealis the Greek name for the north wind. There's a southern counterpart, the southern lights, or Aurora Australis, which look the same as the northern lights and occur at the same time. The best places to see the southern lights are Antarctica, the southern parts of Chile and Argentina, and sometimes New Zealand and Australia. Although you can see them only at night, because daylight obscures them, auroras are caused by the sun, by charged particles, mainly electrons and protons, which escape from the sun's surface and travel out into space. Some of these particles are captured by Earth's magnetic field, and then drawn into the upper atmosphere above the poles, where they collide with atoms and molecules. These atoms and molecules of hydrogen, oxygen and nitrogen gas gain energy from the collisions and as they lose this energy, emit light of various colours, especially green, red and blue, as well as some ultraviolet and infrared. Most of the light in an aurora is produced between 90 and 150 kilometres above the ground, although it can come from higher up. The appearance of auroras can vary from a glow near the horizon to patches that resemble clouds, arcs that curve across the sky, and coronas that spread out from a point and cover much of the sky. The brightest of auroras look like curtains, and can be bright enough to read by. The great majority of auroral displays occur where hardly anyone sees them, in the so-called auroral zone, a narrow band of latitude between 10 and 20 degrees from the geomagnetic poles. A region that currently displays an aurora is called an auroral oval. Auroras seen within an auroral oval may be directly overhead. If seen from further away, they light up the poleward horizon as a coloured glow, as if the sun were rising in that direction. Auroras are sometimes seen at lower latitudes when there's a geomagnetic storm. Such storms are caused by an increase in the intensity and energy of charged particles from the sun following a coronal mass ejection, a sudden eruption of material from the sun's surface. The sun goes through a roughly 11-year cycle of activity. Large geomagnetic storms, and therefore major auroral displays at lower latitudes, are most common around the peak of this cycle. You can check if auroras are likely where you live at various internet sites, such as the one mentioned in the description. And if you have any questions, just add them to the comments below. Thanks for watching.